everybody, welcome back to Pokemon Blue. It's awesome, I only got like five and a half hours of sleep. I forgot to post this on the forums that I usually go to until I woke up. I fell asleep in the process that it was uploading. So, um, uh, yeah. Anyway, decision made, we're going to Future City. First, however, we will get TM39, I think, which is Swift, from this lady. Uh, you know who could make good use of that? Starfire, that's who. Yesity, yesity, desity? Actually, I'm not even sure what that means. But we'll hang with it. Goodbye, Tackle. Encountering a slew of water types. However, we're gonna go with the type disadvantage. Why? Because I like to live life dangerously as well. Or what's the quote? I also like to live life dangerously? Whatever. It's been a while since I've seen Austin Powers, okay? Deal with it. So we will just swift you. Um, how did that miss? Oh, is it the 99.4% chance of all accuracy again? Guess you encountered the 0.6. Anyway, Poliwag should go down to Swift. Hopefully. Maybe. Yeah. Woohoo! Hey, look, it's another freaking Goldie. How fortunate. And I'm being sarcastic. Awesome, no damage. Sea fools, it can be done. <laughs> I am not a small fry. Although I could do from some sort of fries right now. Oh, I hate it when they walk over to you. They always take so slow. Do, 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 do. Fisherman. Oh, this ought to be fun. Tentacool. Uh, they're actually not too bad. I had one in one of my previous Heart Gold runs. They aren't actually as all bad as people make them out to be. Well, that's just wonderful. But, yeah. Anyway, yeah. Tentacruel actually has pretty good damn um, uh, hit points. And uh, special defense later on. Okay, uh, since we're done with um, uh, that leveling session, for Starfire, we will now level up Wayne. Because we desperately want that Razor Leaf move. Because Vine Whip sucks, only has 10 power points, and I could really do without it. Get out of here. Oh, jeez, I should have just kept Flurry on him. Yeah. That is why I need Razor Leaf. To one hit KO everything. Now, and wow, he started his Pokemon Gold run. Uh, if I would have known he would have named his rival after my blue character, I would have named my rival Shepard. Just to spite him. No, I'm, I'm just kidding. But it's kind of funny that he did that. I guess we're complimenting each other's LPs. But it's pretty cool. Uh, Shelter, watch. 
Can I please have that one? It's a decent level already. Please? Can I please have it? Mm. I didn't like you for not using it for me. Tentacle after this, which won't go down easily to vine with, I guarantee. Oh, it's a horsey. Never mind. Kingdra, next generation Pokemon. One of my favorite dragon types, actually. Because it's it's not overpowered, well, really. And he just looks cool. Oh great, does this mean I have to fight the Snorlax with Reef and Bell? Yes, it does. It is time. I could make like in a reference to Zelda's um, not Legend to Zelda Okira at time. Imagine if you could use an Okira to, to wake up a Snorlax. Would it like dance or something? I don't know. I don't know. Uh, Go to sleep. Watch it immediately wake up. Called it. Again? Uh, I was advised not to catch this thing. Uh, considering I only have two great balls, I'm inclined to listen to that advice. And yeah, I don't think Snorlax is going to survive. Hold on, wait. Like Josh, I was never inclined on really filling out the Pokedex. Uh, I couldn't give two shits about it because the prize you get uh, does not benefit you in any real way. And the way to Fuchsia City is now clear! Uh oh. Um. I swear to god, this guy, his upcoming guy has a Voltorb and an Electrode. Terra is both bulky and has good defense. I'm just worried about self-destruct, that's all. Cause you know, you know he's gonna have it. Uh, one of my friends on the other forum, Badnick96, he's also doing a a run of that Pokemon Viet Crystal run. It's a it's a Nuzlocke challenge. Uh, gotta give him a shout out. Unfortunately, a lot of his party has fallen to self-destruct. Called Ed Dudo or whatever the hell Viet Crystal translates it as. But yeah. Kinda shameful. Boom. Okay, we're, we're, I think we're done this. Unless I randomly miss. There's some active gun. No, 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 no. We are to win ors. And that, and in that case, the way to the super ride is revealed. Isn't it great that you can get the super rod before the good ride? And with that, it's time to catch a shelter. Let's do it. I don't know if you can catch one there. I doubt it, though. But more importantly, we only have two great balls, and I don't want to risk anything. So back to Vermilion we go. Super Rod, uh, the Pokemon you can catch in Vermilion City are like, oh. Yeah, thanks for nothing. Uh, the Pokemon you can catch in Vermilion City are Shelter and Krabby. Krabby, yeah. Unfortunately, his, I don't know, he, he's a water, he has a really bad special. It, 
If it were not for that freaking special stat, I would have picked up a Krabby. Because he has, like, amazing attack. Jesus. Is Team Rocket building the... For, building the armor. Are they blocking it? No. No, they are not. What can I buy? I can buy a Great Ball. I will buy eight Great Balls. Um, Alright, now I gotta go all the way back to Vermilion City. I apologize for this. I did not know Vermilion City because the city only sold Pokeballs. Otherwise, I would have gone right back to Lavender Town. Oh, wait, what am I doing? TM29 Psychic. Basically the most overpowered move of this entire generation. However, we're gonna wait before we teach it to somebody. Unless, like, Clefable is the only Pokemon that can learn it. I think that is actually the case. But I'm still gonna wait. Shoulder's more important. Sorry. Of course, that leaves the difficult question of... Who gets... Sh who gets fucking replaced? Luna or Garth? I would say Luna gets replaced because I want to keep the... Uh, I want to keep uh, the Wayne's World thing going on. Fucking Krabby, no. The hooked Krabby attack. Wait, why are you still out? Whatever, let's get some experience. Hooray on screen training. Krabby actually gives off good experience, so if you can fight him a bit, it's cool. And let's keep doing it. Not even a nibble. And you just gotta keep doing it. Be patient. Fishing is the waiting game. Ah, is it another goddamn crappy? If it is, it's oh, there we are. The hooked shoulder attack. Quick, put it to sleep. It has high defense. I'm pretty sure Raph's not gonna kill it. Whoa. Wind attack continues. Okay. Item. Great ball. One, two. Yes. We caught our shelter. Do you want to give a nickname to shelter? Obviously, yes. The question is, what do we name it? Ooh. Uh, I'm gonna be lame. <laughs> oh dear. Yeah. Well, Luna, you are good. But unfortunately, it's time to get rid of you. So yeah, I'm gonna off-screen on my training beam. And now we will teach Shelter Ice Beam, because we are awesome. I'm not sure if it can learn, like, Body Slam or anything. I'm gonna go evolve it into a Cloyster now. Yes, I'm totally going to on-screen this, because you deserve to see a Cloyster. Uh, should I get on the Bicey? Oops. Just 
making it go a little bit faster. Awesome. Spicy. Stupid rockets. Have no sense of personal space. We. We. It's a nice brighter shade of green in here. So yes, we did indeed did return to the sold on department store. <sighs> Give me my water skill. I don't think there's anything Shoulder learns by level up that would be useful. So that's why I'm gonna have all of them right now. Oh yes. Oh yes. Bane is evolving. Don't press B. <sighs> Coffee good. Well, it's closing vertically. The uh, cloister's supposed to close its shell like um, uh, from the horizontal plane, but whatever, whatever shoots them. So uh, yeah, now we go all the way back to the Pokemon Center, and now we store some more items, I guess. Or, you know, we could... Yeah, I'm gonna go clear the other Snorlax now. Before time is up. I'm a busy man. Woohoo! There's the other Snorlax. And then we'll have no use for the Poke Flute, so we can put that back. Actually, that could be rather useful. It's basically an uh, infinite awakening. I believe Wayne is still out, by the way. So it is Weeping Bell versus Snorlax, round two. Place your bets now. Boom! <laughs> oh, wait, it's. Ah. Uh. Come on, Snorlax. Yeah, I could catch Snorlax, but again, I'm not gonna do that. I never really found the appeal behind Snorlax. Yeah, people clamor on and on about his stats, but whatever. Oop, you woke up? Well, you're too late. And before rest. Oh, ow. Yikes! Oh, uh, Wade's probably gonna die now, isn't he? No. Yes, well, acid is a physical attack in this generation, so you screwed the pooch, screwed Snorlax, I'm sorry. Nope, no Snorlax for me. Now I can go heal everybody, and with that, end this stupid session. Yay! So we're probably gonna pick up Enceladon. Which isn't all that bad. Well, with our new friend, things should be a lot more easy. So, next time we're gonna follow the way down to Fuchsia City, routes 12, 13, and 14, and 15. <laughs> so until then, lay.